Hello and welcome to Trade Pandemics. This is a general overview of the software. I'll just show you some of the things that the software can do. So you might want to book, uh, use the booking and uh, book some vehicles before you generate a job card invoice. So let's let's book a vehicle for uh, for uh, Wednesday. So I want mouse click here and book a vehicle. I'll select the service. They book it from about 10.15 until uh, 1 o'clock. Okay. Vehicling. Get the rego. It hasn't arrived, it's depending. Okay, save. So when the day comes, you right mouse click and generate job card. Here's your job card. Put the quantity in. Say, um, job was for $9,000. Okay, I might want to take a deposit of 2000 at the job level before I actually invoice you. So you got the deposit. That will go into a deposit taken account. I'll save. So once you work on the job, etc. Now here you've got orders and deliveries. You can have orders. You can generate purchase orders to buy parts for this uh, job. And you'll have the order number there and the deliveries. And Virtual numbers, you can track everything. Okay, so you don't lose parts. Uh, you can track uh, which ones belong to this job. We'll just show you all the numbers and put them up and all that sort of thing. Uh, okay, but just the basics of it. There's your job card. Now we've got your deposit of $2,000. I'll generate this invoice. Job is finished. Here's the invoice. So there's the uh, deposit on the job. Balance to seven thousand now. You've already received two thousand deposit. We put the next service date in for just about six. Six months from today. It's a bid number, eight a meter. So uh, ninety thousand. Okay. Now we can put a, an SMS, like a lot of programs can send uh, bulk SMSs, just a standard SMS. Trade Pandemic can do that, but also has this special facility where you can write a custom SMS, like uh, uh, just here. And when that next service date comes, it'll send an SMS automatically by itself without any intervention to that customer. Whatever you type in here, it'll send that. Just a reminder to check the intent, for example. Okay, so um, on the next service date, that SMS will automatically be sent out. So your, your, your workshop will be an autopilot. Just send out the SMS on that day. It, um, that's the invoice, so I'll make payment. So the balance sheet is 7,000, because the usual drop was 9,000, we've got a deposit of uh, 2,000, 3,000, part of cash from MasterCard or whatever. I just want to use a card. There you go. Just save it, and the email is saved. Okay. Um, there's a previous, another invoice there. You can really print an invoice, or you can change it and save it again. So, uh, this one. That's what it looks like. Got the, got the logos and dresses up here. Dress up here. That's invoice is vehicle detail. Customer details is email. So you can see that uh, reminder letters, service reminder letters by email as well. There's the uh, next service date, rego due date, balance due. And that's the invoice. You can have that invoice going directly to the printer, or you can just click on that pin icon here in, in the foyer. Okay, the software, um, that's um, just the basics of uh, some of the features and software you can do. Okay, thanks for watching.